Hey guys, welcome back to the game replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy X HD Remaster for the Sony PlayStation 3. Now, a couple of videos ago, I uh, I told you how I was gonna go get balloons, right? Because that little girl in the uh, the square, the Luca Square, and she had a she had a balloon. I said I was gonna get some balloons or something. Well, I'm looking at them right now. They're in the corner. They're helium balloons, they're all filled up, and they're floating there in the corner of my uh, room right here. I'm looking right at them. Uh, and I posted a link, you know, they're on my Facebook page, uh, picture, you know, the picture uh, photo album gallery stuff. So, uh, yeah, the balloons are there, man. I'm a man of my word, I kept my promises. Anyway, uh, I'm sure you're fascinated by the talk of balloons and my purchase of the balloons, but we have a Blitzball game to, to win, I hope. Uh, well, yeah, I hope. I hope indeed. This is going to be a game, and I am going to be at the helm. I am going to be controlling this game. Good stuff. Yeah, we finally got over here to this shot. It's been a while. We've been looking forward to this shot, haven't we? All right, Waka. Waka's not doing too good right now. Waka, are you okay? Mm. Ah, the game starts soon. No time for warm-ups. Ready? Let me at him. All right. I got something to tell you, boys. After this game, I'm retiring. I promised myself this would be my last tournament. Win or lose, I'm quitting Blitzball. But you know, since we're here, we might as well win. Yeah! Uh, mind a bench. <sighs> I'm warming a bench. He's taking my place. All right, boys, let's win this one. Let's make the goers goners. Let's blitz! <gasps> I saw you floating there, on the sphere. Oh. Hey, you weren't supposed to see that. Oh. Uh. You really... Gave it your all, didn't you? All right, boys, what are we gonna do? Win! For Captain Walker. <gasps> this is it, folks. In just a few minutes, the championship game. My best memories are here. Waka, captain of the Aurochs. This Blitzball Championship game can go one of two ways, with a win or with a loss. And I'm gonna do everything I can to win this one. But who could have imagined? A championship game between these two teams. Our legendary Luka Goers going against the horrendously ill-fated Besaid Aurochs. This looks like history in the making, Baba.
already going at it, folks. The goers are taunting the Aurochs. Blitz off! Oh, it's go time, and I'm listening to the Blitzball theme, the remastered version of it for the first time. What do you guys think? Wow, it's it sure is blue and sharp and bright in here. <laughs> so this is it, folks. This is Blitzball. This is the mini game in Final Fantasy X. Some people hate it. Some people love it. Some people just shrug their arms about it. You know, uh, at first, I had no idea what I was doing, and I couldn't really play this Blitzball game. I couldn't really do it right. Couldn't do it up right, but, uh... You know, you really get the hang of it, and not only does it become, you know, pretty, pretty easy for you, the player, but after a while, it actually kind of does get a little repetitive. Okay, so uh, this is set on auto. I stop the gameplay myself. You know, the timer is in the bottom right. You know, the stats of whoever has the ball and such in the upper right. Uh, this is on automatic. I'm just gonna put this on uh, manual A. Okay, so uh, I gotta brace myself now because I am gonna be piloting the guy who has the ball. Yes, piloting. Okay, here we go. Oh, I actually forgot about this. Yeah, the formation. Um, I'm gonna keep it on normal. You can do mark mode like a man, man to man. And then there's like right side, left side. That's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, so folks, uh, here we go. Oh man, okay, that was the wrong button, that was the right button! Uh, oh no, not a good way to start! Okay, but, you know, it can be okay, because I'm gonna break through Grav here, and hopefully I can, uh, hopefully I can get by, and I'm gonna do a pass. Uh oh, he's gonna do a Venom Tackle! Oh man, he's gonna successfully grab the ball. So, uh, basically folks, you can tackle, you can pass, you can shoot, uh, what else can you do? Uh oh. So, uh... With all of those things, you can do certain moves like uh, Venom-type moves or Wither-type moves or, uh, you know, certain shots. There's a whole bunch of moves you can perform and learn. Learn, by the way. There we go. So now, yeah, if you just hit the square button, you can stop uh, the game, basically, and you get your little action commands sheet list. And, and then you can do, you know, passing and shooting, or you can just go back to dribble. So, uh, basically, the strategy for this, folks, is pretty simple. Give the ball to Titus. Titus is the guy you want to give the ball to. Uh, these, uh, you know, these periods or innings or halves. I believe halves, yeah, that's what they're called. They last five minutes apiece, so we gotta get to work. And this game can be won or it can be lost. Yeah, we can, we can just lose this game. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get into that right now just yet. All right, um, we'll be fine. Well, I'm just listening to the remastered version of this, so sometimes I just want to kind of not talk here. This is just really cool. I just want to make sure everything's set. No, manual, okay, and normal. Just want to make sure it's set on normal. Okay, so I'm just going to try and draw you guys over here. What's your pass like? Seven uh, for pass. That should be enough. Uh, like I said, Letty is the passer, so, uh, for this first battle of Blitzball, like, a Letty to Titus connection is really good. What, what is Jasu's speed? Jasu and Dado can get pretty good speed. Um, but, you know, this is the first match, so, you know, our stats really aren't gonna be, uh, kick-ass just yet. Okay, so, I'm gonna pass to Titus. Give the ball to Titus. That's how you, that's how you win this game. That's how I win this, uh, this game. I should be able to get by one of you. What do I have set up here? Dorum. Oh man, that's close. That is close. Her block, uh, her block is pretty nasty. I'm gonna try and break through Dorum. Now, what do I have on my shooting commands? I got nothing right now. Oh, nice. She was unable to get it. Shoot, I got 10 for shoot. This guy has eight for catch. Oh, and he got me, man. I wasn't close enough, perhaps. I mean, it's pretty balanced out. You know, even though Titus is our best shooter, the goaltender has enough, uh, you know, goaltending stats to 
you know, actually defend, you know, pretty decently. So once again, I'm just gonna kinda, I wanna just duck down here a little bit. You know, I'm gonna pass over to Letty. You can see Letty's pass attack is a little higher. Yeah, what you wanna do is you kinda just wanna draw some people away from like Titus and over to you, but not too close. Not too close, oh, 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 nice, here we go. Now this, hopefully this is perfect. Now this is plenty of passing, uh, you know, stats to get this ball over to Titus. Got enough in my pass attack. There we go, come on, come on. You don't always wanna break through Dorm or uh, the other defender, what, uh, Balgurdia or whatever her name is. Okay, let's try this again, come on, baby. Buka! Oh, ho, 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 come on! Whoa! Woof! Balgerda, that's right. That's the other defender. Yeah, two chicks are the defenders. Oh man, I don't know if this game can be a little sexist uh, against the uh, the ladies, but the ladies are usually defending, at least at first with a couple teams. What's up with that, man? What's up with that? Ladies watching this, what's up with that? But I believe as, you know, this goes on, there are some Oh, I don't, I don't like this right here. There are some uh, ladies who are uh, attackers, man. Offensive. They go on the offensive. All right, Jasu. Basically, folks. Oh man, I'm gonna run out of time here. And we're gonna go in the halftime. But you know, it's okay. <laughs> Let's just shoot it. We're uh, we're gonna be out of time. But it's okay because we're gonna take the time to reconfigure a couple things. And it's halftime. The goers are just playing great, Baba. Really great. So, folks, after every half, or after the game itself, you go to this menu right here, and of course I'm telling those who don't really know that well, those of you who have played this, I'm sure have a better understanding. But anyway, you get some experience. Uh, the more experience you get for the people you use in the game, and I pretty much only used Letty and Titus and uh, Jasu, I believe. So there's uh, the goers, and here's us, and yeah, you can see who gets more EXP. So Titus is, now this is very important, Titus's technique slot has increased to one. So now we can equip a special move on the Titus and that will really help us ensure a victory for the second half. And the second half is usually the half where you win this game. But like I said, you can lose this. And also if you look at the numbers in white, you know, you can see uh, that's what, you know, you get a little increase for your leveling up. You know, Dotho didn't level up. Uh, he's in like orange. All right, so uh, Letty's pass is up yet again. That's good stuff. Uh, eight, you know, for endurance. Uh, the HP, you need higher HP levels for when you perform special kicks and attacks and blocks and, I don't know, all that stuff you do. Good stuff. I'm gonna win this, folks. Zone defense, boys. Stop those goers. <sighs> what about me? Get the ball and just shoot like crazy. Goers are going down. Yeah! Shoot like crazy! Down! All right, hustle! Okay, so now this is when, oh man, sphere shot, good stuff. This is when we get to set a couple of slots. Titus is the only one who has an available slot. So we can go in here and check him out. And there is our jet shot, folks. You can read it right there, HP cost 120. Uh, current HP, it's kind of weird how it positions your current HP right there, I don't know. I feel like it can be overlooked. Anyway, current HP 166, a jack shot costs 120, so, uh, take a shot, that's pretty much it. Uh, anyway, it gives you a plus 5 for shooting power, and it knocks away up to two opposing players. Very, 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 very useful, as we all know. Uh, I'm gonna go over to the next page. Uh, well, hold on, you know, I'm gonna... Yeah, okay, so I took away another skill because I want to show you guys that here on the on the page here. That is the spear shot. That is like, you know, in case we didn't learn that jack shot on the boat, if I didn't perform the moves correctly or, you know, just said, ah, the hell with it, we would have had the opportunity, of course, still to use our spear shot, which is a nice move. HP costs 90. If you double that, that is 180. And, well, sadly, that's not enough to perform the shot twice. You do get, uh, man, it's been a little, it's been a little while. You do get HP back as you move around the, the spear board. 
So uh, we could... We could get a chance to do the sphere shot twice. Anyway, it gives you a shot, power plus three, uh, adds random amount to uh, the shoot. Now here's the question, what should I do? I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with the spear shot, to be honest. And it could end up uh, being the better move anyway, really. Yeah, the jack shot could get rid of a couple of defenders, but uh, eh. Anyway, now what we're gonna do is setting our mark. Makes players follow their mark in mark mode and learn their techniques. Players can only learn uh, text highlighted in blue. So uh, basically, folks, what this is, we're gonna try and learn um, abilities from the other team. Uh, Grob is the only Grob is the only guy. Grob Venom Tackle. Who would be a good choice? Jasu. Yeah, why not? Yeah, Jasu. I guess. We'll put him on that. That's pretty much it. This is this is early on in the whole uh, Blitzball process, folks. You know, we don't have a lot of stats, we don't have a lot of skills. So we're gonna proceed, this is gonna be the second half, and uh, I'm kinda hoping I win this game. I would like to get a win, folks. That would be nice, for numerous reasons. Let's do it! Blitz off time! Blitz off! I was so hoping you'd get the ball, Letty. Good stuff. Okay, so I think we're ready to roll out. You know, folks, the funny thing is, when you're manually moving the player around, most of the time, you look at the map grid in the bottom right-hand corner. You don't really look in the sphere pool, you know, because the camera is moving around and it looks just kind of funky. Ugh, you know what I mean? So, the majority of the time, you're just looking at the grid itself because you want to keep away from players and or you want to get after players, this and that. Okay, anyway. Oop, 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 oop. Whoa, whoa! Oh no, oh, that was close. Oh, what do we do, what do we do? I, uh, I don't have uh, a long amount of time. I gotta get things taken care of. I don't like that I'm keeping this close. I would have preferred to have gotten a shot off and a goal, really. Uh, in the first uh, half, I, I really wish I could have made it one nothing, but uh, let's pass to Titus. God, we gotta get, we gotta get in their their zone. Okay, I'm gonna pass this back to Letty. They're being aggressive. Oh God, Titus, your pass! Oh man! Whew, this is dangerous. Now, the thing with Dato is his pass is really terrible, too. Titus, why is your pass so bad? Oh, what do I do? Jasu, your endurance. We gotta... We gotta make some headway here. We gotta get forward. We gotta go! We gotta go! Maybe I should've went with the jack shot, right? Now, if I can just break through Balgerda, that would be nice. <laughs> Jack shot. Did I make a mistake, or is this gonna work out for us? If I can just get past her, this is gonna be a goal. I mean, I got the spear shot. I'm gonna be adding to my shooting power. Yes! Mm. I am very, uh, I'm pumped up, aren't I, folks? There we go! There you go, that's what I'm talking about. The crowd is cheering for the Orox. Isn't this exciting? I can talk a little bit more about this game, but I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna wait just a tiny bit. Oh, that was great. So I got the lead. This is a good thing. I've had the ball for a while, haven't I? Now, I am kinda on a little defense here. Not much I can do. Sometimes there's not much you can do until you learn some moves. There's only so much you can do on defense, folks. You know, I couldn't control any of those moves. You know, they tried to tackle with, with the limited amount of tackling knowledge they have right now. And he passes and I just have to sit here and wait. That's why this game can be frustrating and that's why this game can be lost. Uh-oh. All right, come on. Oh! Oh, no! That, that is not good. 214. Hmm. 
We're at 214 in the second half. Okay, let's try and bring it a little quicker here, you know what I'm saying? Okay, now I'm gonna have to get through uh, one of their defenders again as Titus. I'm gonna have enough passing power to put it over there. Good stuff. I hope only one defender. I didn't go with the jack shot. Oh boy. Oh no! Oh, that is bad. I got through too. Come on, I need this goal! No! The fans are getting impatient. They're calling for some action. Everyone seems to be calling for Waka, folks. Say, where is that player going? He's leaving the sphere pool. He may be injured. To be honest, I did kind of feel left out, but... It really was the Oryx and Waka show, after all. I wonder what's happening. The crowd is going wild. Ah, oh, it's Waka. He's back on the field and ready to go. The Oryx seemed glad to have him back. I actually would have had enough time to have made that last shot, folks. I was aware that the action was going to stop around then. I didn't know precisely the second, but, uh... Okay, we're good. I didn't know precisely when, but I had an idea and I wanted to at least get there for a shot. And they actually got it off. Uh, pity it didn't go in. Anyway, folks, Waka is back on the f uh, field. And uh, it's crazy, man. Very appropriate. This is Walker's last game before retirement. Let's see if we get a win, ya? Yeah? Good stuff. I'm gonna win this, folks. I am not losing this game. Imagine if we go to overtime. I hope I can pass it over there. Seven should be enough. Waka, how is your endurance, by the way? Eleven? Hmm. Should be enough. Should be! Come on, let's take this home! Come on, Waka, we can do it, man! Here we go, break through Dorum. Shoot! And Waka knows a Venom shot. That's another good shot, cost uh, 20 HP, and you can see the increase from 13 to 16, and that should be enough. All I have to do is break through the defender. Goal! Yes!
two to one. Do I have this one wrapped up, folks? Is there enough time? We're still, we still got one minute to go. One man breakthrough. Come on, Waka. Ah, oh, God, we have such lousy attackers. Boda, have you been in this game yet? Have you done anything? Get in there, Boda, come on! There we go. Three defenders, only a one-man breakthrough. Boda grabs the ball! Oh, Boda, you're not on the bench! Do I have time? Come on, Waka! We still have a little time! Maybe enough time for one more shot! Here we go. No defenders. Venom shot. Come on, baby. Goal! Oh, this one is over, folks. <laughs> and that's what I'm talking about. The Besaid Aurochs defeat the Luka Goers. Oh, that was so great. Hey, Bixen, what happened? I didn't see you out there. Get out. Get out, Bixen. Get the hell out of here. Good stuff. That was uh, a well-fought game. Um, one time when I was playing this game, I just want to quickly tell you, I was playing this game a long time ago, and I got off to a tremendous lead uh, in the first half with Titus, you know, before Waka even stepped back in. And I can't remember if it was three goals or five. I suppose it was five goals. I must have scored five goals in the first half and there was it wasn't a cutscene or anything but uh it was a little you know snippet from the announcer in the bottom left hand screen you know where the words go saying uh you know the aurochs are pummeling the goers or something like that like this is this is a blowout folks this is out of hand the aurochs are actually pummeling the goers and uh well titus was shown in the spear pool and he was kind of doing like this you know, he was pumping his fists and doing like this celebratory little dance there. It was nothing special, it was nothing big, but uh, it was still pretty cool. Who wouldn't love to kick the goer's ass? Anyway, folks, we just obtained something special there, good stuff, and uh, that was an awesome victory. Unbelievable! The Aurochs win, folks! This is one for the record book! Oh, man. Save your current game. You have earned a trophy teamwork. Yeah, man. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, you know, I can I can save the game. Sure, why not? These are all my saves. I make many saves of, you know, because, uh, because of my, uh, because of the games I'm playing. Good stuff. Anyway, folks, I think I'm actually going to call it a wrap right here. Woof! Right after the Blitzball tournament, it was uh, it was crazy and intense, and uh, yeah, there was uh, there was a possibility that I could have lost that game, but I won. We can talk more about what would have happened uh, if we lost the game. Well, nothing too big, but I can go into this later. Anyway, I'm gonna call it a wrap right here. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Of course, leave me those comments and tell me what you think. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. I will see you guys next time. I am out.